Good morning, everyone. Gajin here in beautiful British Columbia, Victoria to be specific. And you don't really see the beauty right now, but you will, because I'm going to take you outside. I'm going to show you some awesome, awesome videos, some awesome shots with the brand new Olympus EM1X. Yes, that's what I'm shooting on right now. This is a pro solution from Olympus. So you pro shooters out there, you're gonna really value a lot of the features that they've thrown in. And we're gonna talk about those features and I'm gonna test them out to see what it can do, what it's capable of. And at the end of this video, try to find out who this camera really is for. Right now I'm using the EM1X. It's a sample model, a pre-production model using pre-production software. That being said, it's pretty close to what the final result is gonna be like. The other thing to keep in mind with this system that it's a micro four third solution. Smaller sensor, smaller body, a lot more portable. So if you're looking at something that's gonna give you a lot of telephoto range, but not weigh five and a half kilograms, this is something that might interest you. The cool thing about this camera is that they built it in a way where all the buttons and dials have different textures and different heights so you know what you're using without having to take your eye off the viewfinder. Another thing Olympus has improved here is the autofocus. They took their system and souped it up and they gave it some unique features. So if you're a stickler for autofocus and you are shooting a lot of the same things over and over again, there's a couple of benefits to be had. You can customize the autofocus. You can choose between their 121 points and choose a rectangle in either direction that you find most conducive to your environment and you can build a system that works well for the type of shooting that you do. And just before I get off the topic of autofocus, the cool thing about this camera is that they rated it for negative six stops of autofocusing ability. So even in darker environments, you can be confident that this phase detect system will be able to catch focus on your subject. There's several other cool features. There's a live ND filter that you can put on and turn on and when you're taking your pictures, you can see that in effect. You can see maybe it's a waterfall or a stream of water. You can turn on that filter and get that nice dreamy look right in camera. On top of that, you get the image stabilization that Olympus is known for. On this camera specifically, they say it's the best available right now, but seven and a half stops, seven and a half stops of compensation. What that basically means is you can go handheld at very slow shutter speeds and grab the shot that you wanna grab. So who is this camera for? Well, after using it for an extended period of time and in various conditions, I will say it's a specific audience that Olympus is going after, a very niche group. People that are gonna be in real trying environments, maybe it's really wet or really, really hot, whatever it may be, but people that need something to keep up with the conditions that they're gonna be around. And also for people that need to pack a light, you know, the ability to carry up to 600 millimeters of zoom, for example, in under three kilograms, if you're the type of person that's gonna value that and that sort of environment speaks to you, then this might be the camera to get. This might be the only option available. And I gotta say that seven and a half stops of image stabilization is a real game changer. It's better than what I've seen on other cameras. And I gotta say at the moment right now, it's probably the best thing I've seen, especially when it comes to handheld photography. There's a lot of cool features in the Olympus EM1X. I gotta say that it's not meant for every single photographer out there, definitely not. But for a lot of people that are looking for this sort of feature set in a body that's as durable and rugged as this, well, this might be the only camera to get. Thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you next time.